Welcome to Grilled, presented by Big Green Egg. I'm Nick Mangold, former center for the New York Jets. My guest today is active defensive tackle, Steve McClendon. Come on in here, big guy. How, How we doing? How you doing, baby? Looking good? Ready to go? Oh, yes. We're gonna have a little fun today, all right? We're gonna be doing a little cooking, a little yucking it up, uh, and we're gonna have a lot of fun doing it. Okay. All right, so today for you, I thought it'd be a little fun to have a little tasting. We have impossible meat and we have real meat. And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna do a spicy burger with some jalapenos, some pepper jack cheese, the meats, all the fixings, and we're gonna have a blind taste test. All right. See if you can pick out which one's which. So we're gonna make them exactly the same, so that way you can't tell me, well, I know this one didn't have mustard on it, so. Right, right, right. Uh -huh. We're thinking about this. So we're gonna chop up some jalapenos. So I'm gonna put these in. If you wanna mix the jalapenos into the burger meat, all right. All right, and then make two patties on I'm that just... sheet over there on that side. Now, it doesn't have to be pretty. That's the best part about burgers. You do a lot of cooking at the house? I do not. You do not. <laughs> Is that a decision because you don't want to, or it's the season and you don't have any time? It's the season. Exactly. It's the season. Exactly. So we're making big burgers here. Oh, yeah, big burgers. All right. Big guys. Yep. All right. All right, now if you want to do those, and then try to make them as equal size to those okay. patties. Because again, possible. I don't want any cheating here. Like, all right. I know the big one is the real meat. All right, all right. Ooh, there's some peppers in this one. Mm -hmm. Got to have a little spicy. Yeah. You know how D-Line likes to do it, a little spicy. Yeah. A little extra flair. Just a little extra. Mm -hmm. uh, with the sack dancing, <laughs> the tackling. It's all there. You don't have to hide it. We yeah. all see it. <laughs> now, let's get you to wash those puppies. And then we'll be back and we'll throw them on the grill. Got those clean paws back in? Ready to All go? All clean. All clean, good. All right, so grab the pepper and give a nice little sprinkle uh, on all four patties. Don't want to put too much. Listen, sometimes you can never put too much. Now we're going to throw, sprinkle some salt on there. You know, the salt really lets the, the meats do the talking. Right. That's what brings out the flavor. So if you want to bring that tray over here, we're gonna pop them on the big green egg. All right. And we're gonna grill these suckers up. That's the true sizzle reel. While we wait here on these delicious burgers before we flip them, tell me about burgers in your life. My dad makes these humongous, huge burgers. and. When I see burgers, I was like, my dad used to make this burger that nobody could eat a whole burger. Mm -hmm. So now, I always try to compare every burger to that burger. Okay. But his burger is probably one of the best I have ever had. So I'm getting compared to Pops today? Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> that's going to be... All right. That's challenge accepted. All right. Those things are looking great. We're about ready for cheese. What y'all do, you've worked too hard today. All right. I need you to go sit down, relax. Burgers are coming. All right. All, All right. right. I was going to blindfold you, but I figured they actually came out so well, I didn't need to. You give me the honest feedback. Not only for, you know, the, the meats, one impossible and one real, but also, you know, the overall burger. Big burger. Uh-huh, big, big mouth burger. Good bite. Actually, they're both really, really good. Mm-hmm. But I can tell a slight difference. A slight difference. You can tell a slight difference. But it's shocking, right? Very, very. This is the impossible meat. That is this correct. This is the, the regular burger. That's correct. But when you take a bite of the impossible meat, it still has that same crunch. Same. That, that, the same char that you get from uh, being on the big green egg, just like the real meat. Right, right. right. That's pretty good. Well, it's really you good. Picked, you picked right, so congratulations. What was life growing up? You know, where'd you grow up? Give me, give me a little, little backstory here. Uh, born and raised in Ozark, Alabama. Mm -hmm. um, one thing we love to do, we love to cook out. Mm -hmm. We always get together and have huge cookouts. And like I said, man, Burgers was my dad thing, but this burger is 
pretty darn close. <laughs> oh, um, I think you're just saying that because I'm no, man, right here. Because you know what? I never had jalapeno peppers in a burger. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so mm -hmm. this is the first for me, uh, so which is, is really good. I got to tell you, you did a great job helping. For a guy that says he doesn't <laughs> cook. I beg to differ. You were mixing it. You had it covered. It was pretty soft. Thank you, Steve, for being on Grilled, presented by Big Green Egg. Uh, this was a lot of fun. Uh, you know, we were yucking it up, cooking. Uh, again, keep eating. It makes me feel good. Warms my heart to know, you know, people are enjoying my food. Uh, but I really appreciate it. Thanks for coming out, and uh, we'll see you all next time.